I'm AJR and today I'm taking you through a resistance band, glutes and arms workout, okay? You will ideally have two bands please, I've got a heavier one for the legs and a lighter one for my arms, okay? We are going to obviously get warmed up first of all and I will explain how our session will work. So just a light jog on the spot for me first of all please. We're going to take two leg exercises and two arm exercises, 25 seconds work per exercise, five seconds rest, and then we will repeat them. So we're going for eight rounds in total, okay? Keep that nice and light, feet just coming in and out. Breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. Please make sure you've got plenty of space and perhaps some water in case you do need a drink throughout, okay? You can pause this video at any point. Bring those feet up towards the bottoms. Keep that breathing steady. Keep the arms swinging with us. Good, and grab that band, the heavier one. We are going to pop that around our legs, okay, just above the knees. To continue our warm up for a second, just half jacks in and out. So we're just starting to warm up the sides of our legs and our glutes. We sat down a lot with office work. The likelihood is we probably don't use them that often. And that's why this workout is really great. Keep breathing. Keep it light on the feet. Lovely work. Last couple. Three, two, one. Relax there, good. Just grab a hold of somewhere for now. Pop one foot across the other knee and sit onto it. Hold it out for a few seconds, drop that chest down towards the shin. Lovely work, and swap it around. Now, if you're only working with one leg band, I would perhaps suggest just skipping ahead very quickly. Okay, and you can watch the four exercises so that you can do all of the leg exercises and then all of the arm exercises to say you're stopping over a five seconds break is very quick, so you may not have time to swap it over. That's why ideally you would have two bands for this exercise. Okay, your lighter band for the arms, remember, heavy band for the legs. We're gonna stick the timer on. Our first exercise, however, is two side steps and then two pulses. Okay, two side steps, two pulses. Get yourselves ready, listen out for that timer. Three, two, one, let's go. Good, good. Now, when we go into our arm exercises, keep that band on, okay, around the legs. We're just going to grab the arms, uh, the band of the arms, so that we can move straight into that exercise. We've got five seconds here. And relax, lovely work. Five seconds break. Grab that band, keep it in front of the body. Elbows tucked in, open out. Open out now. Try not to let those elbows move at all from the size of the body. We're strengthening up what's called the rotator cuff around the front of the shoulder. Again, if we're sat at this quite often, it doesn't get worked. That's why injuries often occur. Five seconds here, guys. And relax there. Keep holding that band. Taking it into a squat and a kick back. Ready, let's go. Keep swapping legs. Each time that you come up from your squat, look for a nice straight leg. If you're not sure, find somewhere to look for your reflection. Squeeze that glute. Soon as the leg bends behind you, that exercise sort of ends, okay? You won't be working the same muscle groups as if you keep that leg nice and straight. Last one, fabulous work. And our last exercise, arms are going up. We're going to pull down. Squeeze and up. Now this is called a lat pull down. Imagine that little section underneath the armpit, just around the back. Okay, that's the muscle that we're working here. Keep the control. Pull it down nice and strong. That other arm stabilizing us up at the top. Three, two, one, relax there. Keep holding that band. Guys, we are repeating one more time through. Two side steps, two pulses, let's go. Keep breathing. That's it. Keep that other band to hand so that you're ready straight away for your arm exercises. Breathe. 
really good corrective exercises for posture, these exercises. Three, two, one, relax there. Grab that band out, we've got our rotator cuff. Squeeze those elbows in, 25 seconds work. That's the one, keep it moving. seconds left here. Watch that the rest of the body is not twisting, it's purely just that arm rotating out to the side. Lovely work, relax there. Taking it into our squat and kick back. Off we go, 25 seconds work, squeeze the glute. That's it, keep squeezing, keep breathing, tummy's nice and tight, keep that balance. We've got 10 seconds left here. Keep it steady. Five seconds and one more exercise to finish. Good work. Yes, grab that band as band up, overhead. Okay, pulling down 25 seconds. Squeeze that muscle, the lats, all right, just around underneath the arm, put it around the back. Squeeze the arm down, look at distance. Don't let the band just ping back up. Almost there, five seconds left. Three, two, one, and relax there, good. Pop those bands down to one side. Guys, can we have a quick drink? We're going to have a very quick cool down. Obviously, you're welcome to skip this if you're going on to other of my six minute workouts. The stretch we did at the beginning, take that leg across. Sit the uh, shoulders down towards the shin. Keep breathing. Good, bring it up, swap it around. Other side. Brilliant work. Both arms coming behind the back, clasp them together. Lift them up, lift the chin and the chest. Work. And then our last stretch, we're reaching one arm up, one arm below, fingertips together. Keep that breathing going. Deep breaths. If you struggle with this one, you can always grab a band, swap arms over, and you can use that band to reach the hands closer together. Okay. Lovely work. Shake everything out. Guys, that was your six minutes resistance band glutes and arms. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like, subscribe, comment on all of these videos. I really do appreciate it. I'll see you next time. Well done.